Hello everyone, it's Glenda and welcome back to my channel, Creative Grandma. Today's video, I'm excited to show you nine brand new colorways of the Premier Puzzle Yarn. If you watch my channel, you know this is one of my favorite yarns from Premier. It has a wonderful look to the yarn and they have nine new colorways. They also have some wonderful free patterns on their website for this yarn and I'll be showing you those free free patterns and I'll show you what this yarn looks like when it's worked up into afghans. So let me tell you a little bit about the yarn before I show you those new colorways. This is a 100% acrylic yarn. It's a wonderful yarn to work with. They have a picture of an afghan made using this colorway here. It is 328 yards, 300 meters, 7 ounces, and 200 grams in each skein. It's classified as a number 5 bulky weight yarn. It's machine wash cold, tumble dry, and it has been tested and approved against 350 harmful substances. So you know it, it is safe for even the most sensitive of skin. So let's go right to their website and let me show you the those brand new colorways and those beautiful afghans made with that yarn. Now I'm on Premier Yarns website. This yarn is $8.99 a skein. Now I just found out about the yarn today so I didn't have time to order it in but when you go to the website and I'll have a special link that will take you directly to this page and you can view the colorways up close and personal on your own computer. So right here you're going to see the word new 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 down on the bottom nine colorways. So I'm not going over over all the colorways. I'm just going to show you the nine newest colorways. So I'm going to start with the first one. This is the one you're seeing now and this is called Kickball. This is color 1050-44 Kickball. Look at these gorgeous colorways. Now on my screen it has the fall colorways of browns and oranges and cream. And when you scroll down you're going to see a little box and when you click on this box it's going to show you a photo of what this yarn looks like worked up. Now these are knit samples so it will look a little bit differently when you're crocheting and depending on what pattern you're using, what stitch pattern, how wide or how narrow is how your stripes are determined because this is a self striping yarn. But I just thought this was gorgeous with those fall colors. So that is the first new colorway. The second colorway is called Chess. This is color 1050-45 and I'm seeing purples and blues. And then when you scroll down you're going to see the little box. Just click on that box and then you're going to see what this yarn looks like worked up. Now this one surprised me because I was seeing the purple and the blue but then it has like a green I can't tell if that's a greenish yellow or if it's green, but that is what it looks like worked up. So that one deceived me a little bit because I didn't see the yellow and green in that one. But again, that is what it looks like knit up. Let's go back to what it looks like in the skein. And this is what it looks like online. And you have to remember, there's four different colorways in these skeins of yarn. So if you're only seeing two colors, make sure that you're scrolling down because I don't want anybody to be disappointed in the colorway they choose. So again, when I'm looking at this, I'm only seeing the purple and blue. And then when I clicked on the sample, you can see those other colors in there. So let's move on to the third color. The third color is color number 1050-46 Hide and Seek. Now I'm seeing beautiful shades of purple and pink and it looks like a light cream or white mixed with a light brown and a dark brown. So when you scroll down and click on the little box, this is how that sample is going to work up. So it's best to make sure you're clicking on those samples on the bottom, but 
I thought this one was really pretty. Those shades just blend together really nice. And that, again, is the color Hide and Seek, color number 1050-46. The next colorway is Sunny Sky. This is color 1050-47. Again, when you click on that little button on the bottom, it's going to come up with the knit sample. So this is what it looks like, and I thought this was really pretty. Just the way those colors blended together, those blues and yellows always look wonderful together. And then you almost have a brownish orange tone mixed in with the yellow, and just gives it a really pretty look. And that is called Sunny Sky, color number 1050-47. The next colorway is color number 1050-48 Citrus. This is beautiful bright yellows. I see a little bit of an orangish brown and almost a lime green. So just a really pretty combination. And then when you click the sample on the bottom, you can see how that works up with those bright yellows, the orange, the yellow, and then that mix of brown just blending everything together. And that was color 105048 Citrus. The next colorway is Candy. This is color 1050-49. I'm seeing what looks like a lavender, an orange, a lime green, and I'm not quite sure what the fourth color is. I think it's a darker orange, so let's click on the sample. Isn't this beautiful? This to me almost looks like a southwestern sunset. All those beautiful different shades when the sun is setting with a red, an orange, yellow, and some light lavender in there. That is really pretty. So that is Color Candy, color number 1050-49. This is my favorite so far. The next colorway is color 1050-50 Fresh Blooms. Now this one on my screen, I'm seeing a beautiful light pink, almost pinkish lavender. A really pretty yellowish green is what it looks like. And I think there's some light blue in there. So let's take a look at the sample. And remember, these are knit samples. Isn't this pretty? Oh my goodness, now this is my favorite. And this is the problem when they come out with these beautiful different colorways. How do you choose? Now this one I think has to be my favorite. The other one I really like, but this one since I see it, I like the way the colors blend so softly together. And this is probably going to be on my order list. I have to make something out of this colorway. I just think it's just so beautiful. And again, I love the way those colors are just so soft and blend together so nicely. And this was the Fresh Blooms color 1050-50. The next new colorway is color number 1050-51, and this one is called Pool. Now this one I'm seeing blue. It almost looks like a gray or white mixed with that blue. I'm seeing some yellow, a greenish color. So let's hit on the knit sample. And look at this one. So on this sample, it almost looks like a brown tone. And I can't tell if that's lavender or blue mixed in with that brown. But I love the way they have the yellow mixed with the blue and it helps blend it. I see the blue clear down on the bottom where it's blended with the brown. And again, this is color number 1050-51, pool. The last colorway is color number 
50-52 Seashore, I'm seeing blues. I'm seeing a tan color. Now, what I want to tell you is when I get done showing you this last color, I want to show you some patterns that's on Premier's website that was made out of this yarn. That way, you get a really good idea of what these yarns look like when you're crocheting up the full skein. It gives you a much better idea than just these small samples. So let's take a look at the sample. Oh my goodness, isn't this pretty? I love how it has the blue and just a light color above it. And then that tannish color mixed with the blues underneath. This is really pretty. If you're a blue jean person or you live by the beach or a lake, I can see this being a really beautiful afghan. So now what I want to do is I'm going to scroll down to the bottom of the page. And when you're on the page, again, I'll have a special link. And when you're on that page, if you scroll down, you're going to see some patterns. So let me zoom out so you can see all the patterns. So again, when you scroll up, you're going to see the yarn. Just scroll down and you're going to see what says patterns. And then these patterns are afghans made using that new yarn. So let's click on the first one. This first one is for my knitters. This is a knitted pattern. This is the wavy scallops throw. It measures 44 by 39 inches and it only takes three balls of the new color pool, color 1050-48 pool, but it's a knit pattern. So you can see that beautiful afghan. Let me zoom up. This is what that yarn looks like when you work it up in a knit pattern. Also, when you're on the page, I'm going to back off a little bit. When you see this gray box right here, it says download pattern. So you just click on that link and here's the pattern. And you can print it right out and get started making your afghan. The next free pattern that's available on Premier's website for these new colorways is the Granny Chevron Throw. It measures 44 by 36 inches and it is a crochet pattern. Now most people want their afghans to be a little bit larger than that, so I would say order an extra ball or two and really make a nice size afghan. This afghan was made using color number 1050-46 candy. But isn't it wonderful to see what this looks like worked up? This is my second favorite color, so this is a wonderful pattern. Now remember, these are all free patterns on Premier's website, and you can use any of the over 30-some colorways to make your afghan. If you see a pattern you like, choose the colorway you like. You don't have to use the colors that's shown. Now this is a crocheted pattern, and it's called the Sideways Bobble Throw. It measures 44 by 35 inches, now this afghan requires four balls of color number 1050-49 seahorse. The next free pattern is the box shells throw. This is a crochet pattern and it measures 47 by 34 inches. It requires four balls and it requires the color sunny sky, color number 1050-44 sunny skies. Now remember the measurements when you're on the website. If you want a larger afghan, you're going to need to purchase more yarn. Now this video is just to give you ideas of what the yarns look like when you're making afghans and to show you those new colorways. So those are just some of the free patterns on Premiere. And if you see on the side, the left and right side, you can click those arrows and it's going to show you more and more patterns made using the Premier Puzzle yarn. So all kinds of inspiration on Premier's website, all kinds of beautiful afghan patterns. So make sure you check out those patterns. And I also want to remind everyone when you go to the Premier's website, I'm going to zoom up a little bit and I want to show you at the top of the screen, if you're in the continental USA, you get free shipping on orders over $75. But if you look up here, you're going to see what says rewards. If you click that link, 
and you'll see this little box that pops up that says welcome to Premier Yarns and become a member. All you have to do is hit that join now button and every time you make a purchase at Premier's Yarns you're going to earn points. It tells you how to earn more points, how to redeem your points, and how to earn extra points for doing referrals. So that's just a way of Premier thanking you for purchasing their yarns and then you can save money on future orders by using your reward points. So thank you everybody for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed seeing these new colors. I'll be ordering some of these colors in and when those colors come in I'll work up some samples but you can get a pretty good idea of what these colorways look like by looking at those patterns that are already made with the yarn on the website. And remember they have many free patterns to get you inspired and get you started with some of those new colorways. So until next time, happy crocheting everyone!